just peeling away. So feeling away is great job. Feeling away, great job. These are process instructions, and it's pretty much she's her unconscious mind has completely sucked her into this trance. So the unconscious mind is already doing whatever it needed to do for her. Um, and it's she's already it's good that she's surrendered and feeling into this feeling. She already intuitively knows that there is something for her. And so by me saying feeling away, it's just pretty much um a an instruction to positively reinforce the subconscious mind and, and and saying okay go ahead feel feel it um and then as you can see she had a good sigh and then after that sigh I said doing a great job um sighing is another unconscious moment it's right now she is in this mode of processing and we want to keep her there and process instructions are one way to um keep them in that moment and you and um just allow their mind to do what it does best and so, Rena, um, what I just said there are process instructions. Um, there you go. Yeah, process instructions. Good thing to add when they're actually doing it, when you're feeding their words back to them and um, just keeping them in that moment. So feeling away, right? Because she said, I just want to feel it. I just want to sit and feel it. So that I'm saying, go ahead, unconscious, feel away. Um, and what you it's kind of like the mindset also is that you can have two conversations really a conversation with the conscious mind and a conversation with the unconscious mind her unconscious mind just sucked her in like right now which is really cool um so we want to keep her there and by saying feeling away go ahead um and when she's breathing out great job kind of like positively reinforcing the subconscious there's again something's happening here um, and we just want to allow the subconscious to do whatever it is that needs to happen because kind of like what she said, I want to shake it. So this is her conscious mind going, she's trying to control it, right? Like, I just want to get rid of it. But her unconscious has said, no girl, feel this. There's a lesson. So right now she's learning this lesson and we just want to keep her. Just be silent. And obviously, we're just watching her, making sure that she's safe. Charya, I know that you know you're safe here with us. You can see her now. She knows that. Safety is one of the biggest things that you want to prioritize in all of your session, in all of your hypnosis and coaching sessions. Um, Charya, you know, to right now knows that she is safe and she has opened up if she didn't feel safe during the session she wouldn't have gone into this trance anyway but then again you're reinforcing your client's safety within your sessions is super super important um uh, especially if the, the emotions are very intense try right now um you know, looks very much in control of the situation but if she were to be very emotional uh then you know, reinforcing safety. And also in ACH trainings, uh, we have the ab reaction drill to just, just in case our clients uh, have an abnormal reaction. So it's good to have these in your back pockets if you don't have it already. But safety is key and just watching your clients um, and just being silent, which I know <laughs> during this demo, because it is a training uh, program and, um, and it is a demo. Then I was explaining to Rena what I was doing. Uh, but even then, even though I was talking to Rena, Charya was still doing whatever she needed to do. Uh, but if this were to be a one-to-one -one session, I would definitely just keep my, my mouth shut, watch the client, and occasionally add in process instructions. <laughs> 